When I was nine years old and diagnosed with epilepsy, it was really scary. And part of that was I didn't know what epilepsy was. I knew that I had to go to the doctor and I knew there were a lot of wires attached to my head and I didn't know what was happening to me or when it would happen next. Eventually, after speaking with my doctor and my parents, hockey actually helped me find the best way for me to cope with my diagnosis and stand out in a positive way. Through lots of hard work and years of practice, I was selected for the Olympic women's ice hockey team. Hi, I'm Hannah and I'm 11 years old and I love to play ice hockey. When I was one years old, I found out that I had epilepsy. It was hard to make my friends understand my seizures. I was so scared that I might have a seizure when I was playing hockey. Our experience with Hannah having epilepsy and playing for Minnesota Special Hockey, it's been incredible. You know, we've met so many amazing people along the way. They're so cool about it. They just go on, they play through it. While we get nervous about it, of course, it's their life. We want the world to know that, I mean, Hannah is just, she's a true warrior. She's been through so much and she doesn't let anything stop her. She's super cool. Through my involvement with the Epilepsy Foundation's Athletes vs. Epilepsy, I was invited to be a part of the Medi Kids Explain Playing Sports with Epilepsy comic book. I was so excited to be featured in such a great initiative to educate kids about playing sports and being active with epilepsy. I was so excited that I was gonna be in a comic book. I can finally show the world what Hannah can do. It was so much fun meeting Chandler. We had so much fun playing together. Me and Shanna both had epilepsy, but we don't let it stop us. I knew at a early, early age that I wanted her to know that this wasn't gonna define her. We've taught Hannah that she can achieve anything that she wants, and that epilepsy is just one little piece of her life. Seizures can be really scary or embarrassing, but they don't have to be a setback. There's no reason that you can't continue to do the things that you want and achieve your goals. Don't let epilepsy get in the way of your dreams. I know you can do it. And that's a wrap, people.